for news and gossip is hotting up we approach J the opening of the January window. The Premier League's big boys will all be weighing up potential deals as they look to strengthen ahead of the end-of-season run-in. Other sides across England, Scotland, and the rest of Europe will also be looking into splashing the cash. But who is heading in, and who could be heading out? Check out the latest gossip, deals and rumors below. Transfer News Live Updates Thursday, November 22nd Gossip, Rumors, and Deals 8.40 am. Sari wants Scry near Chelsea boss Maurizio Sari has requested the club sign pound 70 am rated Inter Milan defender Milan Scry near, according to reports. According to The Sun, Sarri has added the highly rated center half to his January wish list and asked the board to pursue his signature in the new year. The Slovakia defender has been strongly linked with a move to Manchester United with Jose Mourinho keen to land a center back in the upcoming transfer window. Sarri has told the Chelsea board he is happy with the players he has for now but believes his defence is an area he could strengthen if given the opportunity. Skriniar is under contract with Inter UTIL 2022 but sources in Italy claim he is growing frustrated at the club's decision not to pay him the wages he wants. At 30 am, Milan and Arsenal battle for Yetter AC Milan are preparing to do battle with Arsenal in a bid to sign Sevilla striker Ben Yenner. Yetter struck twice in five minutes at Old Trafford last season to send Manchester United crashing out of the Champions League. The Frenchman has found the back of the net 10 times in 17 appearances this season attracting the interest of top European clubs. Calcian Ricardo reports that Yetter is an alternative target to surprise Rossoneri targets Zlade and Ibrahimovic. The report states the 28-year-old would be a June target and by that point his price tag would be relatively cheap. m Liverpool linked to Lib 1 playmaker Liverpool are plotting a move to sign Lyon playmaker Hussein Aouer, according to RMC Sports. The French radio station claim the Merseyside Giants are keeping close tabs on the 20-year-old after his impressive start to the season for the Lid 1 club. RNC Sports report the big European clubs are taking real interest in Aguayer, who is also on the radar of Liverpool's Premier League rivals Chelsea. Sam Aguayer on the ball for Lyon, Pip, Getty, 10.05 p.m., Giroud dismisses more Chelsea exit claims Chelsea striker Olivier Giroud has dismissed talk of a Stamford Bridge exit, insisting there is no question of him moving away from the club. He told Telefoot, I feel like I'm going back a few months with these questions. So I asked the same questions before the World Cup.
I'm at peace, happy with this title of world champion, and that's the best thing I could do in my career, I'm putting a lot of things in perspective. I do not need to put a lot of pressure on me to have more playing time. Of course I want more play time, I'm a competitor, I want to play, I'm in a big club where there are always big strikers. I'm not going to let go, I'm going to continue working to make my way in. Today there's no question of moving, of changing anything, I'm going to hang on. Do not count on me for give up. Eight point fifty PM. We do not need it at Arsenal. Robson Arsenal do not need to sign Borussia Dortmund and Germany midfielder Julian Weigel, according to ESPN FC pundit and ex Gunners star Stuart Robson. He said, well Ramsey's not getting in the side so they've got Granit Xhaka, they've got Gendouzi as well, they've got Torreira as you said. Weigel is a good player. At the moment, I don't think Arsenal need him. So I'm going to have that as a miss. Seven point twenty p.m. Winger influences PSG interest in Ramsey. Arsenal star Aaron Ramsey is now being chased by PSG thanks to Arsene Wenger, but his injury history may scupper a move to France. The midfielder is being tracked by a host of European outfits at present, including Bayern Munich and Juventus. According to Paris United, PSG have now joined the race for Ramsey after glowing praise from his former boss Arsene Wenger. The ex-Arsenal boss was a big fan of the 27-year-old and has a good relationship with PSG big league author al -Khilafi. And Paris United claim Wenger was asked by Thomas Tuchel about the Welshman. However, the publication claims Ramsey's injury troubles in recent years may cover any deal. Six point zero five p.m. Arsenal I Liverpool rage for LB Moreno. Arsenal are reportedly considering a move for Liverpool defender Alberto Moreno amid doubts over Nacho Monreal's future at the club. Gunners boss Unai Emery already has seed Cole Asenak, and Ainsley Maitland Niles and Granit Haka have filled in at left back this season. But, according to the Mirror, the club are now scouting for a permanent replacement for Monreal, with Moreno first choice. Moreno, 26, is a free agent next summer and Emery knows him well from their Sevilla days so with Arsenal's limited budget he could be a genuine option. Holland is happy for Manchester United to sell Paul Pogba, Pip, Getty, 5.05 p.m., in says Pogba say, he's an attention seeker Manchester United superstar Paul Pogba has been labeled an attention seeker by ex-Red Devils midfielder Paul Ince amid continued reports of a move away. I can't say I'm surprised to hear about the Paul Pogba rumors suggesting he's interested in leaving Old Trafford in January, Imps told Paddy Power. He said recently that he was happy at Man United, but I didn't believe any of that.
I believe a Pogba move away from United would suit both parties. If we're being honest, he's never settled on his return to the club. He's been inconsistent in his performances, going from world class to looking bang average, and there's always been whispers and transfer talks surrounding him in that time. His personality is to stir up rumors, like getting in a picture with Messi recently. He's an attention seeker, he wants people to talk about him. 4.15 p.m., Coutinho Claus keeps Barthin away from Liverpool Barcelona will have to pay an extra £89 million to Liverpool should the Spanish club sign one of their players before 2020, the Times say. The article claims the Reds included the premium as part of Felipe Coutinho's £142 million switch this January. The extraordinary clause is believed to have been added by Liverpool's sporting director, Michael Edwards, in a bid to ward off interest in the short term. Barca chiefs are reported to have been unhappy about the term's inclusion, but could do little to dissuade reputable negotiator Edwards. Two point fifty p.m. Inter Milan cold sell Ivan Kos to Man Utd. Inter Milan are weighing up whether to cash in on Croatian star Ivan Kos, who is a long-term transfer target for Manchester United. Cos is liked by Jose Mourinho but he's failed to get a deal done in the past few years. But the Suns say he could now get his man, with Inter weighing up a £31 million sale to United. one40 p.m. Man City want Ajax star Dejong Manchester City will be forced to break their transfer record if they want Ajax ace Frankie Dejong. The midfielder has been earmarked by Pep Guardiola as a possible replacement for Fernandinho. But the 21-year-old will cost a mega £75 million should they want to get a deal done. Barcelona are also keen on the player. Transfer News Live Rashford and Canty to get new deals, Arsenal I Pepet, Pit, Getty slash AFT, 12. Thirty PM, Barcelona Big Week meets Neymar's dad Neymar has reportedly told pals he expects to be back at Barcelona next year, and a key figure from the club has now met the Brazilian's dad. UOL is Sport Report Andre Curry, Barcelona's advisor in South America, jetted to London this week to watch Neymar train with Brazil. They add he met with Neymar's dad amid the claims the PSG star is heading back to the no-camp. Twelve p.m. Arsenal want Nicolas Pepe. Arsenal are keen on Lille star Nicolas Pepe as a potential replacement for Danny Welbeck. Welbeck is set to be out until the end of the season following a nasty ankle injury. And the Gunners could now move for Ivorian ace Pepe in January to come in for him, the Times report.
They could face competition from their Premier League rivals though, with Everton, Manchester City and Tottenham also sniffing around. Transfer News Live Nicolas Pepe is liked by Arsenal, Pip, Getty slash AFE, 11.30am, Man UTD move to keep Rashford Manchester United are ready to double mark this Rashford's wages to pound 150 comma 0008 week in a bid to keep him at Old Trafford. Chief Executive Ed Woodward is keen to tie down the England star long term before the end of the current campaign. Rashford put new contract talks on hold last term after concerns about his role in Jose Mourinho's side. But United have no intention of losing him, and will fight to keep the striker on board. Eleven AM Canty contract close and in hands of lawyers Chelsea midfielder N'Golo Canty is close to seeing his new contract being made official at Stamford Bridge. The ex-Leicester player is poised to see his salary practically double to around pound 300,000 a week. Canty is said to have indicated he is happy with the five-year offer on the table, which would keep him at Stamford Bridge until 2023.